Legged Manipulator. Imagine a robotic dog that can do more than just walk. It can throw objects with Olympic-like precision. That's the innovation behind this Legged Manipulator robot, which has been trained through millions of virtual simulations. Engineers tested everything from wind resistance to rough terrain in digital environments before transferring those skills into the real world using advanced, sim-to-real, technology. The result? A four-legged robot capable of hurling items up to 5 meters with remarkable accuracy. Its agility and adaptability also mean it can move smoothly across different surfaces, making it suitable for challenging missions. While it can play badminton for fun, its real potential lies in serious applications such as search and rescue. In dangerous or hard-to-reach environments, this robot could carry out precise tasks that would be too risky for humans. It's a perfect example of how playful experiments in robotics often evolve into tools with life-saving uses. Autonomous Walking Robot This walking robot is unlike most others you've seen, it's not built piece by piece. Instead, it's 3D printed as a single, solid structure made from a soft plastic similar to the cushioning material found in sneakers. That design gives it flexibility and durability while keeping things very lightweight. The robot doesn't rely on motors or gears to move, instead, it uses air pressure. Tiny chambers inside its body inflate and deflate, creating movement in a surprisingly natural way. While it only walks at about 4 cm per second, it's incredibly stable and even water-resistant, making it reliable in different environments. The best part is accessibility. This type of robot can be printed using a standard home 3D printer, meaning advanced robotics is moving closer to everyday hobbyists and engineers. It's a small but exciting step toward affordable, customizable robots that could be designed and printed right at home. Bionic Ants Imagine a colony of robotic ants working together just like their real-life counterparts. This is exactly what German company Festo has engineered. Each bionic ant measures about 13.5 cm long and is equipped with an impressive set of features, including cameras, infrared sensors hidden in the abdomen, and mechanical jaws strong enough to lift and carry loads. Just like natural ants, these robots don't just act alone. They collaborate, coordinate tasks, and yet still retain the ability to make independent decisions when necessary. What's even more fascinating is how they recharge. Instead of plugging in, they connect via their antennae, just as real ants communicate by touch. Running up to 40 minutes on a charge, these ants showcase the potential of swarm robotics, where small units can join forces to solve big challenges. Beyond being an engineering marvel, they point toward a future where robotic colonies could tackle construction projects in extreme places, even building bases on Mars. Boss Manta Ray The Boss Manta Ray is a fascinating creation that blends biology with advanced robotics. Built with support from the German government, this bionic stingray is designed to glide through the ocean almost as naturally as its living counterpart. Its main purpose is underwater reconnaissance, but its abilities go far beyond just spying. This robotic stingray can assist in monitoring marine life, inspecting wrecks, or even collecting water samples for research. Inside its sleek body lies an impressive setup, sonar systems, cameras, and scientific instruments all tucked away in a design that mimics nature. Thanks to its wing-like fins, the Boss Manta Ray can move with incredible precision, even skimming just 20 centimeters above the seabed without disturbing its surroundings. With such technology, it's not hard to imagine it one day helping to uncover shipwrecks, explore lost cities, or even shed light on mysteries like the Bermuda Triangle. Bionic Swift The Bionic Swift is no ordinary flying robot. It's a mechanical bird designed with a truly remarkable feature, artificial feathers. 
Each feather is made from lightweight foam and mounted on flexible carbon fiber pins. This design allows the wings to move almost exactly like those of a real bird. On the upward stroke, the feathers fan out to reduce air resistance, and on the downward stroke, they fold tightly together to generate lift. The result is an elegant and natural-looking flight that feels almost alive, despite being entirely robotic. But it's not just about looks, the Bionic Swift demonstrates an innovative navigation system. Instead of relying on cameras, these robotic birds use radio modules placed around a room to find their way. This means they can fly independently and coordinate with one another in enclosed spaces. In the future, this technology could lead to fully autonomous aerial robots capable of navigating complex environments with precision, opening new doors in surveillance, logistics, and entertainment. Chimp The Chimp robot truly lives up to its name drawing inspiration from the agility and adaptability of an ape. Built to handle rugged and unpredictable environments, it moves confidently on all fours but can also rise to walk upright on two legs when the situation calls for it. What makes Chimp especially versatile is the combination of its rubberized tracks and dexterous hands with opposable thumbs, allowing it to grip tools, turn valves, or even climb walls with surprising precision. While the robot is designed to operate autonomously, human operators can step in and take control whenever needed, ensuring safety and adaptability during complex missions. The real purpose behind CHIMP is life-saving. Its creators envision it taking on the most dangerous tasks in disaster zones, such as navigating collapsed buildings after an earthquake. By combining strength, balance, and fine motor control, Chimp represents a new generation of robots built to go where humans can't, reducing risks while increasing rescue potential. Hexa At first glance, Hexa looks like a futuristic six-legged spider, but under the surface, it's a powerful, portable robot designed for creativity and innovation. Originally introduced as the world's first affordable, next-generation programmable robot, Hexa quickly drew attention not only for its unusual design but also for its advanced capabilities. Compact enough to fit into a backpack, it runs on a custom-built operating system called Mind, which is based on Linux and tailored specifically for robotics. This system makes Hexa more than just a robot, it's a collaborative platform. Users can build, share, and download new projects through its dedicated app store, unlocking endless possibilities. Thanks to its onboard camera and array of sensors, Hexa can process real-time data, learn from its environment, and adapt on the go. However, what was once seen as affordable has since become a premium gadget. While early backers grabbed it for around $500, today the price can be nearly 10 times higher. Despite that, Hexa remains a fascinating tool for developers, hobbyists, and educators exploring the future of robotics. Le Machine Robots Le Machine, a French art collective, is famous for building some of the most breathtaking giant robots the world has ever seen. Their creations look like mythical creatures come to life, performing in streets and public squares around the globe. One of their most iconic robots is the 14-meter-tall Minotaur, a massive half-mechanical, half-hydraulic beast weighing over 4.5 tons. To bring it to life, a team of 17 operators work in perfect synchronization, controlling everything from its limbs to its lifelike movements. What makes the Minotaur even more mesmerizing is that it doesn't just walk, it appears to breathe, giving the impression of a living creature. La Machine has also unveiled other awe-inspiring creations, including an 18-meter spider and long maw, the Dragon Horse, which tells a story of myth and humanity. Their performances, often staged in cities like Toulouse, transform ordinary streets into living theaters where fantasy collides with engineering. With these giant robots, the boundary between imagination and reality nearly disappears.